Hey Virgo, Kim Enchantress here to do a timeline reading for August 2021. Now it may not play out in August for you, but whatever the situation, it will start from August here, Virgo. Now I was feeling this is about a woman in your life who is burdened, possibly religious or in pain, but she doesn't question anything that you do. She's in a commitment with you. And it's a deep commitment. It's someone you've been in a relationship for a very long time. And this could be about feminine duties that you have to take on whilst this person's not well. This is you being bound to a relationship. Or well, this is your partner, Virgo. This is a deep commitment and burdens of responsibilities that go with this commitment. Now we have... The engagement card that's fallen out of the Romance Angel deck. And I feel, um, Virgo, that uh, maybe uh, you've made a commitment and you're wanting to take your relationship to the next level, but this burden that's put upon you is um, making you question that. Now, I feel like this card is reassuring you so that you'll choose to release any worries about whether you'll get married because I feel that you will. This is a deep romantic love here, Virgo, and I feel like you should treasure it. Um, the deeper meaning of the card relates to commitment. You've made a commitment to yourself first. And then you've got to establish boundaries about what it is that you won't accept in your relationship and also in other areas of your life, like your career and lifestyle, etc. Now, the next thing to do is honour your self-commitment by taking decisive action and telling your partner how you feel truthfully about their behaviour. Maybe they're taking a little bit of advantage um, of you with the duties etc while they're not well maybe they're getting a little bit better and they can do general things around the home and this is concerning you now we also have um, in the Lenormand cards the cross the woman the ring the fish and the tree is a significated card so definitely you've been going through tough pain it's taking uh, it's, it's, it's actually exhausting you here Virgo and playing havoc on your health as well maybe um, you know you're going through this tough pain because your partner's suffering from an illness but I do feel like you have a physical connection with this person as well You've been together for a very long time and you've made that commitment to, uh, to go through bad and good times together. Now, with the um, Wisdom of Hidden Realms, we have the Ring Master of Scrutiny that's fallen out for you, number nine. It's about having clear vision and details to how you want to... Um, proceed now I think you need to pay close attention to the smallest elements of what's being presented to you on your path I feel like this ally is on your side to point out the deeper meaning of what unfolds in your life and they're here to remind you that every moment counts staying present in this perfect moment observing the minute things leads you to the manifest your highest good and grandest desires now Grand gestures are for other times. It's the smallest acts that really count now. So anything that you do to help your partner while they're not well is helping them. It doesn't have to be the biggest things. You know, you'll have um, magic come into your life by doing this. Okay, now we've also got underneath the Lenormand cards. We have the whip, the mice, and the bouquet. So the whip is about conflicts, 
lot of repetitive. The mice is about stress and anxiety. And the bouquet is about being happy. Maybe you feel like the conflict's now dwindling away and you're starting to show your kindness during this time. You're exploiting your gratitude for this person and you're going to make that grand gesture to this person. You're anticipating. Maybe give them some flowers to make them feel better. Now we have also, with the Crystal and Gemstone deck, Relationship Quartz Crystal. It's asking you, are you ready to meet the love of your life or reignite your con connection with your partner? I feel it's the later. So cultivate the loving relationships in your life. Change your mindset to think as we rather than I to attract or renew more love into your life. So think as a couple and not as a, uh, a solo person. Now we've got Archangel Shamuel who's coming through and they're helping with healing your relationship. So you need to stay in your quiet space. I attract healthy, harmonious relationships into my life. My colleagues, friends and family respect me and accept me exactly as I am. It's wonderful to be liked and loved so much by such wonderful people. So that's an affirmation. Now this could be your partner or this could be you, Virgo, um, as we have your card right smack bang on the focus card. Now I do feel like the timing for this is slow and gradual development. It can possibly take up to five years. Now your person will be wearing green or maybe they've got green or hazel eyes. But I feel like uh, it's for longevity. It is a deep emotional connection that you have. And you may take your uh, next step to committing to, to getting married. I definitely feel like you'll be in more control of uh, your future together. So whoever this is meant to go to, please like and subscribe to the channel. If it didn't resonate, check your Moon Rising and Venus sign out. I'm almost completed the uh, star signs. And um, hit that bell if you want to receive my notifications when I do the readings. Now, please stay safe, guys. Appreciate you coming to the channel. And God bless you all. Bye for now.